to announce our official return to show business and our new tour. Hey, look at me on the surfboard. Just wanted to give a just wanted to give a quick shout out and say what's up to Jack Moria. Thanks for watching, dude. You for the boys. Doggy. 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 What's up guys? I just got in the car. I'm heading out to Northfield right now to a place called Right Touch Studios. I'm going to be recording. But to hopefully be the final voiceovers for the TV pilot um, before they deliver the show to the higher up execs and see if we get a fucking series. So, I don't know. Northfield. Never even knew this place existed, but this is, should be cool. You yeah. Voiceover sheets for our pilot. Sorry, horse. Main guy shit. Okay, we're going residential. Alrighty then. Here she is. Looks like the spot. 13. Ben? How you doing? Hey, kid. Nice to meet you, sir. Good morning. Yeah. Longport? Longport, Ocean City and Longport, actually. Ooh. Ocean City and Longport. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Bug juice, dude. One, one, one. <laughs> dude, I was watching it last night. Yes, I do. Yep. This season on the idiots. This season on. Okay. <laughs> and find. Okay. And find the answers. But only four of us are actually dumb enough to go beyond the search bar and find the answers. So you don't have to. This season on... Oh, sorry. No, you're good. Before Ben leaves, and I'll say on camera just in case. Super brave blind guys. Craigslist paid off, and we found two super brave blind guys. Give me, give me the... Dude. Coming up on The Idiots. Coming up on The Idiots. The idiots. Oh, Alright man, thank you guys. I really appreciate it. Ben will be in touch. Thanks, Rhett. So, Rhett. But don't forget to don't forget to send those people. Big Steven could be the difference. I got you. Thanks, bro. Thanks, Kit. Thanks, B seventeen. Thanks, Rhett. Um stoked. Uh, Fucking stoked right now. <laughs> there he is, people. Kit, the legend. <laughs> I mean, I've done stuff with BBC, uh, I mean, lots of different voiceover stuff, for, like nationally. Well, stuff you did really well. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. I appreciate it. Thanks for uh, having me. Yep. Just got out. Voiceovers. He was telling me I did a good job. Which is... <laughs> cool. Fuck yeah, dude. Woo. So, heading home. Hopefully I can surf. Woo.
What? From the best, I'm getting a haircut already. Why? Sucker. <laughs> John Hernandez is an animal. Oh, El Stompo. Charlie. What do you want, Stalker? Tell me. What? What do you want, Stalker? No, thank you. You got a video of us handshaking? Yeah. Jack Little, the military haircut. Dude, are you getting my haircut? I'm not. Laying it. Alright, dude. Oh, yeah, I'll see you around. Alright, dude. <laughs> this is the legitness right now. Living the dream, people. Phew. When you're a film god. I don't, know, I don't really care too much for photography so much. Oh, yeah. What's up, guys? I just left my new friend Jonathan's house. He lives right here on Rhode Island Avenue in Atlantic City. Right by the surf break that we always go out at. Um, he gave me a bunch of sick footage from the past couple days. And he gave me some really sick drone footage that he's been shooting of the city over the past month or so. So I'm gonna be editing all this together and mixing in Changalini's footage. And I'm fucking stoked because this is just great. Like, I've been surfing really well. Changalini got some amazing water footage and John has some really sick land angles drone angles and drone angles scenic angles of the city so mix it all together and we're gonna have ourselves a nice video so fucking really happy about it and yeah gonna be good so heading home right now Whew, so tired definitely some coffee in my future Woo! this is a normal ass day I'm driving home from Atlantic City. Till that motherfucking beat drops though. Yeah. Just another day driving home from AC. Feeling crazy like Pat Swayze dead. Feeling like a motherfucker about to get some bread. Feeling like another brother about to cop some head. Cash for gold. You fucking ass is old. I don't give a fuck about your casserole. About to ask you roll your body. Fucking body you up. About to take you in the back. Wrap you up in my truck. And I'll take some seven up and sip it. Yo. When I flip it, you can't get with this ripping shit. You can't get with the method, kid. You can't get with the freestyles. I'm dropping on these motherfuckers. Body them. About to body it, yo. I saw my boy at the party. Gave him a purple nurple. That motherfucker shouldn't have purposely fucked with Urkel. There it is, boys. After this mandatory team meeting on Sunday, might be heading over. Better not, babe. I'm <laughs> excited to I was very excited. What do you have to say to the Nub Nation right now? <laughs> Why are you spitting chips at my camera? <laughs> I'm <laughs> not filming. I don't need to film anymore. You don't. That's so bad. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry.
Why are you apologizing to me? I was apologizing to the camera. Oh. I was looking at the camera when I said that. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it honest, guys. I got a blendini. What's up guys? Driving back from Jordan's back to my house. Another long day. Some surfing, some voiceovers, a lot of good stuff. I'm feeling, feeling the energy of the universe today. Feeling good about everything. Um, talked to the producers from the pilot. The guy Rhett was claiming he's really liking everything everyone from the network's really happy and uh i don't know man the energy is just fucking good on this one i don't know what's different but i'm just feeling it this time so hopefully there's a lot of good news in our future as for surfing more waves tomorrow and uh life keeps moving so thank you guys for hanging out with me for another day I appreciate the fuck out of all your support and all your love. I love you guys and uh, I've been surfing and editing a ton so I've been kind of slack on getting back to everybody. Um, emails and, and comments and stuff but best way to get me these days is definitely Snapchat because I talk to dozens of people every day on there. It's just a quick response. Um, great app i don't know i love that thing but it's ben gravy with two y's if you want to say what's up please feel free i love hearing from people so i appreciate the fuck out of you guys thank you for watching i'll see you tomorrow for drinking coffee and talking shit i hope that you have a wonderful day you yeah. good night so i decided to turn the camera back on after i started getting upset but, I mean, not upset. I started getting a little choked up because, like, I don't know how to put this into words, but, like, ever since I quit drinking, everything in my life has started working out for me. And, I, and it's not that everything is working out because... So many opportunities have come and gone since I quit drinking that haven't exactly panned out how I thought they would. But just my the whole energy of my existence is so fucking good. Like I'm I'm truly happy inside of my heart and my soul. And I'm pretty much the same guy. Like I have this I I'm no richer. Like I still drive this car like I still surf, I still make videos. Everything in my life is pretty much the same, but it's just like I've somehow through this sobriety I found purpose. And like that's why we always say we made it, like cuz I truly inside of my heart I feel like I made it. Because I'm finally myself and I have the ability the ability to love and spread love and I just want you guys to know that I love you and I wish you luck with anything that you're going for right now and life short get after it you know follow your dreams